Here it comes, attention. And go, and they're off. Now looking good, looking clean both boats out of the first five. Like Radcliffe got a little bit better to start there. And looks like Radcliffe's out by a little bit. They're in the high strokes here. Both boats still in the high strokes. Looks kind of close. Radcliffe's got a little bit of a lead. About 300 in here or so. Looks like Radcliffe by a couple seats right now. Both boats kind of settling into the base here. Same wind as before. A little bit of a, a quartering headwind coming from the Cambridge side. Radcliffe's pushing out now. Uh, they've, they've settled in. They've got moving it along pretty powerfully a lot of a lot of send around the finish in that Radcliffe boat and they're what they're walking out here in these the last 10 strokes they've taken it about four or five seats or so on the, the Georgetown boat and they're continuing to walk so we come up on the 500 so come up on the 500 it looks like there's a probably overlap maybe one or two seats Radcliffe has on Georgetown or excuse me excuse me Radcliffe has about six seats on Georgetown. Radcliffe's at 35 and a half. Georgetown's about 34. Radcliffe is, is out in front now. Looks like the uh, Georgetown bow ball is uh, on the stern deck of uh, the Radcliffe boat. The Radcliffe boat's continuing to move. Moving it along, yep. Definitely, definitely overlap with Radcliffe up by a length right now. A little bit of overlap on the decks. Radcliffe rowing's a little bit higher. When we come in, uh, so we're coming through the 750 or so, uh, Radcliffe now has open water. A little bit of open water, and they're continuing to move. So hit the headwind here a little bit. They're continuing to move. The wind's a little bit stiffer here as we come up on the Mass Ave Bridge. Same as in the Junior Varsity race. And, Radcliffe is now two seats open and continuing to move really smooth in the Radcliffe boat. Very smooth, clean catches, clean finishes, very nice. A little bit longer than the, the Georgetown rowers through the water. And Radcliffe, Radcliffe is uh, now really taking command of the race with about three seats open. Still moving. Yeah, the head and the wind's picking up here a little bit as we come through. Coming up on the thousand, about, about three or four strokes till they hit the white marker. Yeah, and at the thousand, Radcliffe's, Radcliffe's out to about five, six seats to open, and uh, it doesn't seem like anything, anything's going to stop them. There, looks like they're well on their way to taking the 2004 Cup. Barring something, uh, something miraculous here. And both boats, Radcliffe now out of the bridge, Georgetown coming out of the bridge. And Radcliffe, a little bit extra power there, taking a little move here as we come into the, the third 500 of the race, and they're continuing to move. They have about a length now open on Georgetown, and Looking very smooth. The water's flattening out a little bit here. It's gusting. The wind's gusting, and uh, yeah, it's again still Radcliffe by a length and continuing to move. Very smooth. Great race for the Radcliffe boat. back in a little bit here. But Radcliffe really has a pretty commanding lead at this point. Still about a length of open. And we're crossing in front of the MIT Boathouse now. Maybe 
it is a little bit more than uh, one length to open, a couple seats extra. But Radcliffe, now Radcliffe's moving, continuing to move, really laying it on here as they come up on the 500 to go marker. Yep, and uh, yeah, Radcliffe is at the 500 to go marker, and they're, they're putting a little extra on it now. Probably getting close to two lengths to open on this Georgetown crew. Pretty commanding. Radcliffe boat. About 34 and a half, 35. Georgetown boat, about 33. Above the lower. And uh, Radcliffe coming up, coming up on the sprint here. Radcliffe starting to starting to push out. We'll see if they push out like the Radcliffe. The Radcliffe Junior Varsity took a really massive move right as they went into the sprint in about 15 strokes. Took about a not even maybe 10 strokes. Took about a length. Radcliffe bringing it up now. Yeah, bringing it up now. Taking a little extra. You see them taking the back out of it a little bit. A little extra. A little bit of extra power. They're walking out. It's over two lengths open now. They're continuing to move. Georgetown crew now is, is starting to bring it up here as they come into the sprint. Radcliffe looking very clean, very smooth here as we come up to the to the finish. About about 100, 150 meters to go now. Radcliffe by by still about two lengths and, and change of open. Let's see if we can get a Good spot on the times here as they come through. Looking at the finish. Radcliffe in the last five or six strokes now. Looking to be a little over a seven minute race here. Pretty quick race here in this varsity boat. And the Radcliffe varsity now at the line. And the flag down at 7.10. The Georgetown boat coming through at... Seven twenty one, about eleven second margin.